Hi there, it's Murray from Northland Dodge in Prince George. Hey, I just wanted to send you a quick uh, walk around of this, uh, this 2012 Ram 1500 SLT. Um, in terms of trim level and options and features, uh, this is the closest thing I have um, to show you. Uh, I think I'd mentioned like the, uh, the regular cab that we're looking at, uh, eight foot box, is uh, in one of our sister dealerships. So the closest thing in terms of uh, cab box configuration that I had was like the three-quarter ton that I sent you the video of. Um, but I want to just point out what, uh, you know, kind of the trim level and, and kind of what your truck is going to look like. Um, so we'll start up front here. The SLT trim level, like it has the chrome bumper, uh, it has the chrome grill, uh, it has chrome bumper out back. Uh, your truck's going to have these wheels. It's got the 17-inch forged aluminum wheels. Uh, it's white in color. Um, and like I say, out back, it's got the uh, the chrome bumper. Um, you know, it's got the uh, trailer blade, uh, trailer uh, plug-ins on it. It's got a locking tailgate. Um, it'll have the heated mirrors. And they're, uh, they're power mirrors, and also has power windows and power locks. Uh, your truck has the uh, does have the 10-way power driver's seat and the power lumbar support. Um, and it's the uh, exactly the same uh, seat configuration as this, the bench seat. They call it 40-20-40. Uh, the um, Outside seats uh, are independently adjustable, and the uh, the center seat it uh, it does have a it has seat belts for three in the front, so you can ride three. Otherwise, like I say, you can fold down the armrest, and there is a storage compartment in there. It has a power outlet in there as well. Um, inside the radio, this is the same radio that's in your truck, um, other than yours has the, um, the Bluetooth connectivity um, and it also has a button for, um, for voice control. So it'll have a couple extra buttons up here, okay, again one is to activate your telephone and the other is uh, you just press it and you can call out any of the stations. Uh, but it'll have the CD player and also has the auxiliary jack uh, for MP3 player, that sort of thing. Um, it'll have the tow haul mode. Uh, tow haul mode basically it holds it in gear longer uh, when you're up shifting and, uh, and then downshifts the transmission earlier as well. Uh, it has electronic stability control and your truck also has a 115 volt power outlet and that's uh, the plug-in on the dash over here. Uh, it'll have air conditioning and it also has the, uh, the drop-down cup holders that fold out of the dash. It'll have the two. Uh, we'll have the two power outlets. Uh, this one is hot just when the ignition is on, and this one over here is hot all the time. Um, it'll have the uh, the upper or the lower and the upper glove box. Like the dual glove box is uh, part of the SLT trim package. Um, it'll be the same colors inside as this: the black and tan um, color combinations. It'll have the same instrument cluster as this. Um, and a significant part, when you get into the SLT, uh, they have the, uh, the driver information center in the uh, middle here. So it'll have, uh, gives you a compass and uh, temperature uh, radio stations on the very top, and then uh, fuel economy. Uh, so it'll give you your average fuel economy distance to empty. Uh, the bar graph on the bottom gives you your real time when you're driving. Um, tire pressures, corner for corner. Uh, vehicle info. We'll give you your uh, your temperature and pressure reading. So coolant temperature, uh, trans temperature, uh, engine hours, uh, and there's quite a few other things that are kind of integrated into this. Uh, some system setup, some preferences um, that you can set up. Uh, but your truck will have that. Um, 
the four wheel drive control is on the dash here um, and it does have a neutral in it if uh, if you uh, ever have the opportunity to use that uh, cruise control uh, these are the controls for the uh, information center we're looking at now your truck will have uh, actually two buttons up here uh, that, that split and on one side it's a redundant control for your telephone to activate the phone and on the other side uh, it's a redundant control for uh, for the um, radio stations so you can just press it off the steering wheel and you know call out what station you want and it will switch to that so like I say uh, this one is uh, this truck is pretty uh, pretty representative of, uh, of what yours is going to look like inside um, you know it's got the two-tone door panels And again, that same uh, same front seat. Okay, thank you very much.